Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shayla and we are finally doing another 17 album reaction. I've been having this, have been having this, I have had this on my list for forever and now I'm finally here to do it. So I'm very excited. Uh, I love getting through their b-sides and everything and so I've done one, their first album reaction and that'll be linked up there. I've also done, I think all of their title tracks question mark there's been a lot of videos i have a lot of 17 videos but now i'm doing this album reaction which is really fun um they have some unit songs and i think one uh with all of them but yeah boys beat second mini album is the title of this mini album so first we have fronting and we have when i grow up we have OMG or Oh My God, and we have Rock, which the units are interesting, as far as I can tell. It's like hip hop unit plus Hoshi. Oh no, Uchi's in there too. So, okay. They're a little bit different. Um, this one's just vocal unit. Yeah. And then this one's just performance. And then they have one that's all together. So yeah, that's really exciting. I don't know at all what these sound like. So I am, I'm ready. It's, yeah, it's interesting. Like I was listening through um, Face the Sun this morning and like compared to the last album I did a reaction of, it's so interesting to hear just the differences in sounds and like quality of production and stuff like that of the two. Face of Sun is like one of my favorite albums of last year, um, which is funny because I had only listened to it like a week before the year was over, but love that song or love that song, love that album so much. And I'm hoping I can find some more of my favorite albums through listening to their discography. So let's start with Fronting. Turn that down a little bit. a lot she she loves my red sorry some of Vernon's lyrics make me laugh so much actually no I want to listen to this whole part again This part, yeah, 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 this chorus is so good. Okay. Some 
기차인의 딱이 상적이고 너랑 둘이 가는 방향만 맞춤 같이 걷고 해맞게 걸은 반대편에서 마주쳐 있던 신호등 안에서 입 맞추는 거에 대해 너는 어때? I like that verse. That was nice. I like one of his part. I see the pony more no care. Character of man and she jagged must my to more sorry. Yeah, so let me do the day on she jogging my to Mucha, not on me, dang her head. Be your sobank and be on a day. Toxi Mutari give my name, dig a tanky day. To Tonks in Opsi Hebole. Kitcha in the Dagi Sancho Gigo. The Rang to Riga name, Pangang, my mother's catchy goggo. A market got a band of pianos on my chucha, it does she know the yard so in my chunning go and then on the not. I really like this. <laughs> I was about to ask, when's he coming in? I really like the song. There's definitely some, when was this put out? 2015, probably. Yeah. There's definitely some 2015 lyrics. So there, I'll say that. <laughs> and it kind of shows, I don't know. Um, what does it say? I don't know if each of them wrote their own rap parts. I don't know exactly if it was mostly Uji, I don't know. I don't know exactly how they did it, um, especially early on. But <laughs> you can also kind of tell their age <laughs> through some of the lyrics and what they're singing about. But, like, that's more accessible as well to, I'm sure, like, younger fans and stuff like that of the time. So, like, yeah. It's, it's silly. It's fun to listen to. And that chorus was so nice. But, all right, so that was fronting. So now I have When I Grow Up by vocal line. Ooh. Wow. That was cool. This style of singing. Pretty. This is really cute. Yeah, Simcom singing in this kind of style is really interesting. It sounds really cool. I mean, lots of Joshua, too.
It's a really sweet message, and this chorus is really nice and catchy. Yeah, I like that melody a lot. Ooh, I really like that too. I don't think like it's not my favorite of the 17 like slower kind of uh, songs that I've heard, but this album has been pretty good so far. I think they definitely like I don't know. I think the the melodies they're using in this album, especially in their choruses, are uh, very catchy, very nice to my ears. Um, we have OMG, Oh My God, with Performance Line. Let's go. Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> okay. I just thought transformed back to like middle school. <laughs> I love this part. I kind of love this. <laughs> I'm kind of obsessed. Wait, it's instrumental. The yow in the background. <laughs> okay. I love this. This is so fun. That AOAOAO part is so good. I'm getting like nostalgia right now. <laughs> He sounds so young. Okay, flow. Cool. I definitely am. You too. I'd love to see a performance of this because they had to have performed this live at their concerts. Yeah, oh my god, yeah, oh my god, say 
I'm so glad. I'll wait. <laughs> this would go crazy at a concert even today okay I wasn't sure oh I don't know if I like the first one fronting or if I like this one better. I think this one's more fun. Like, I think I would lose it if this was live. Um, I think I would listen to fronting um, more regularly and more casually. Whereas this one, I feel like you kind of need to be in a specific mood. But I like it a lot. Yeah, that's, that's what I'll end that with. But yes... That was really good. It always surprises me how much, how diverse their albums can sound uh, with their unit songs specifically, considering. <laughs> like, I imagine, like, going in thinking everything's going to sound like their title tracks in their early career, and then you listen, and you're like, not what I was expecting for their B-sides, but okay. <laughs> but yeah, that was, oh my god. Um, and then we have Rock, which is the one with all of them in it, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yep, let's go. All of them. <laughs> okay. Ow! Just you, no money, not necessary, hunted and right. Such like a bright sounding like vocal line and <laughs> like melody, I guess. And then we just have that nar, 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 in the background. Okay. I'm liking Wanu's parts a lot in this album. That was... Yeah, because he's purple. Okay. I was like, am I tripping? No. The change-ups in this song... <laughs> Part of the instrumental school. Okay, sing. I think I've heard this, and you know how I did a reaction for my Patreon for Seventeen last week, um, and I did a bunch of their uh, year-end performances, like a reaction to a bunch of their year-end performances, and I'm pretty sure. They did not all, not the whole song, but part of the song. Because I recognize the rock my head part. This instrumental train drop is crazy. This part's really cool. Gerald 
I really like this too. This would also go crazy during a concert. Ooh, I really like that. I want to listen to the bridge. Right here. Such a fun, fun song with fun lyrics. Why is this part the most replayed? Ah, it's just a drop. No, I like that a lot, and it makes sense why they would perform something like that at um, year end shows because that is such a fun song. Well. I hope you enjoyed that. That went by a lot faster than I thought it was going to. I thoroughly enjoyed that album. Like, so I knew most of the songs, or all of the songs, I at least heard them once going into their first um, album, their first mini album. And it's not my favorite thing in the world. I tend to prefer um, 17's newer, like, title tracks and just in general more than their um older stuff but i still like i still like adore you i still like pretty you i still like man say it's just it takes me longer to really get into them um this album i feel like i get a lot more quickly than i did the first one i think the first one um i could kind of jam a little bit more too because i had heard the songs before and I had kind of gotten used to it, but it's not really usually my kind of style. But this one, I feel like there were some really great moments. They really stepped up their games with some of their melodies, I feel like. And, like, the instrumentals on some of these songs were really cool as well. Like, I don't know how many times that one in rock switched up, but it's fun. And I really, really enjoyed it. Definitely stuff that I think I would lose it to watching it live. And I think that... It's cool that Seventeen can make music like that because they're so known for being so uh, amazing in the performance area. So, yeah, love that. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I will be reacting to whatever the next album is the next time I react to one. And, yeah, let me know what I should be looking forward to, if there's any specific B-sides that... Uh, you want me to keep my eye out for? Because I will. <laughs> will I remember it in a month when I get to it? Who knows? But I will try. <laughs> and yeah, uh, please like and subscribe if you want to see more 17. I upload them pretty regularly on my channel. So hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.